I wished for you so much so I sculpted you from clay myself and begged Zeus to give you life. You've told me this story. Which is why tonight I will tell you a new one. A story of our people and my days of battle. Yes! So you will finally understand why war is nothing to hope for. Long ago, when time was new, and all of history was still a dream, the gods ruled the earth. Zeus, king among them. Zeus created beings over which the gods would rule. Beings born in his image, fair and good, strong and passionate. He called his creation man, and mankind was good. But Zeus's son grew envious of mankind and sought to corrupt his father's creation. This was Ares, the god of war. Ares poisoned men's hearts with jealousy and suspicion. He turned them against one another, and war ravaged the earth. So, the gods created us, the Amazons, to influence men's hearts with love and restore peace to the earth. And for a brief time, there was peace. But it did not last. Your mother, the Amazon Queen, led a revolt that freed us all from enslavement. When Zeus led the gods to our defense, Ares killed them one by one until only Zeus himself remained. Zeus used the last of his power to stop Ares. Striking such a blow, the god of war was forced to retreat. But Zeus knew that one day Ares might return to finish his mission. An endless war, where mankind would finally destroy themselves and us with them. So Zeus left us a weapon, one powerful enough to kill a god. With his dying breath, Zeus created this island to hide us from the outside world, somewhere Ares could not find us. And all has been quiet ever since. We give thanks to the gods for giving us this paradise. And the god killer? The god killer? The weapon that is strong enough to kill a god. Can I see it? The gods gave us many gifts. One day you'll know them all. This great tower is where we keep them. <laughs> 